This is information that you need to learn in order to become the only one in your family this holiday season that knows when you should and should not use rechargeable batteries. Let's start with cost. These AA's will be about 80 cents per battery, and these rechargeable batteries will cost about $1.50, but they can be recharged hundreds of times. But that is not the whole story here. Here's the output profile. These values are misstated for no good reason, and these are just lies. This performance curve is the real story. The rechargeables will drain with a constant voltage. The alkalines will just keep on weakening until they finally die. This may seem like a no-brainer, but the alkalines do have one cool trick up their sleeve. These nickel metal hydride batteries will only stay charged for about a month, whether you use them or not, whereas these alkalines can sit in a drawer for like five years without losing too much voltage. Okay, so here's the final actionable verdict. Like 95% of your batteries need to be rechargeable. Alkaline batteries should only be kept for emergencies and certain passive at-the-ready type items. These are things that sit dormant most of the time. Flashlights that are sitting in a drawer waiting for a power outage should be loaded with single-use alkaline batteries. Flashlights for your kids should always be rechargeable. All your holiday items, RC cars, and toys should be rechargeable. Hope you found this information useful.